In October 2016, several British tabloids published a photograph of a silver coin of uncertain size Greek inscription. The coin portrayed depicts of gaunt drapped bus resembling a so-called grey alien. Grey aliens are extraterrestrial humanoids associated with contemporary UFO mythology. The source of the image is credited to the UFO website MysteriousEarth.net where discovery of the coin is ascribed to a group of people who work on a renovation of a house in southern Egypt. It's clearly a hoax. The lack of any attribution, weight, dimension, date, image of reverse, etc. A video or an image uh, is not even shown clearly raises the level of suspicion to an astronomical level. First impression is that this was a real coin or a medallion extensively tooled in order to turn the portrait of a ruler or a deity into a likeness of an alien, like an elaborate hobo nickel. Hobo nickels are an American five cent pieces that have been carved and tooled often with great skill into a novel and startling forms. The craft became popular during the Great Depression 1929 to 1939 among hobos, homeless workers who had a lot of time in their hand, they would sculpt this kind of coins in their free time. Why would anyone create such a fantasy coin? The thought is that the object was deliberately forgery intended to deceive gullible collectors. But on reflection, it becomes clear that no serious collector would be taken by such an obviously told fake. This could be also a creation of UFO enthusiasts attempting to fabricate evidence for ancient astronaut theories. Also a little research revealed that it's not even a real artifact but a heavily retouched photoshop image of an actual medallion in the Roman collection of the cabinet, Cabinet de Melis, Paris. The hoax was uncovered by computer scientist Rolf Bullough. The very rare original medallion depicts Dionysus, god of wine and abandon. The other side, in the obverse, bears an idolized portrait of Antinous, the beloved and companion of the Roman Emperor Hadrian. Antinous, about 18 years of age, drowned in the Nile River in 130 CE. Hadrian was distraught and had the youth declared a god, raising temples in his honor throughout the Roman age, notably in his birthplace. Claudio Polius or Pithion is the province of Pithnia, now Bolo, Turkey. This was where the medallion was stuck. The image of the medallion seems to have been taken from a website dedicated to Antinos. The digital trial led to a Brazilian UFO site that the hawk's image came from a design crowd, an Australian graphic design crowdsource website. In April 2011, Design Crowd conducted a coin of a realm contest, challenging a graphic designer to create images of celebrities on coins. It was a playful creative joke. The Hawks developed when the tabloids took the image and turned into a clickbait UFO story in YouTube and other media websites. To further confuse the situation, the same Egyptian find was given as a source of some 17th century French geotrons bearing images of disc shape floating in the clouds. If you like the video, please do comment about the story and what you think about it and please do subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you.